Good morning, everybody. Chris Seventy here on my morning drive. It's early this morning on January 2nd, a little after 6 o'clock, getting to work early. Uh, try and uh, catch up, get some things done after a few days off. But today, uh, with it being a new year, I just want to talk about you know year-end and getting everything in your business completed uh, in regards to... Um, you know, your bookkeeping, accounting, and uh, getting reports. Uh, a few things, make sure that if you've paid anybody any interest, that you have 1099 statements from them, as well as any vendors who you've paid. I think it's if it's over five or 600 bucks, you gotta send them a 1099 as well and put all that together. I know there was an interesting conversation going on the other day in regards to how many bank accounts that you need and so forth. And I know people were going back and forth on it. My recommendation on that is talk to your CPA and talk to your attorney. Uh, I know there's a lot of information and misinformation that gets put out. And, you know, it's not only dependent upon your business, but also the state you're in and how you operate your business. So just a reminder, not all, you know, two shoes will fit the same individual. Uh, so... Uh, things can be done probably in multiple ways. Actually, I know they're being done in multiple ways. But for me, I like to follow the you know the kiss method. You know, keep it simple, silly, stupid, however you want to say it. But uh, I try and rely on my consultants, especially my attorney and my CPA. Hey, what's the easiest and you know simplest way to do certain things and keep it going that way. So I want to say thank you, happy new year again. Thanks for watching. And again, follow me on this YouTube channel, as well as got some new episodes of the Good Deeds Note Investing podcast coming out. So uh, stay tuned for those. Thanks and have a good day.